Neighbors in Northwest Atlanta are on high alert after a few terrifying incidents. They say men with guns are trying to break into their homes. Fox News' Denise Dillon tells us the neighborhood security patrol is now warning residents to lock up. There have been some attempted burglaries, masked men with guns caught on camera. Now neighbors are on alert and looking out for each other. Taking precautions, but it's it's a concern, concern for the whole neighborhood. I think people who live in the Mount Perrin North Side neighborhood are on edge. One woman showed us this video posted by a neighbor of people with guns wearing ski masks lurking around someone's home. They run away after the house alarm makes a high pitched noise. The Neighborhood Association sent out a letter saying this was the third attempted burglary in 10 days, including one on Harris Glen, where people smashed a front window to get in. When the homeowner screamed, they ran off. This community already has plenty of security, private off-duty APD security, license plate readers, and cameras on many corners. So we're paying for the security to come around. We're paying for those uh, cameras that the, I guess the police department, it's my understanding, will take over after a certain amount of time. But again, that's all things in and above and beyond what we're already paying for with, the, with, with our taxes. The Community Association says they will add extra patrols and they're urging residents to make sure they lock their doors and set their alarms. When we leave the house for any reason, even if we're just walking the dog, we're locking our front doors. We're, you know, if we're gone for more than that, we will we'll arm the alarm. Tom Reeder says it's disturbing, but he knows this neighborhood isn't the only one dealing with crime. It's, it's a concern, it's, but we live in a city. The community association is also telling residents to check their cameras, make sure they're operational and charged. In Atlanta, Denise Dillon, Fox 5 News. Good advice, Denise, thanks.